Good day and welcome to the vlog. Today we're out, we're gonna meet up with Josh, test some new stuff on the bike, and have a good time. Let's go. Can definitely taste the smoke a bit, but it is definitely better than it has been in days. And at least that has gotten me off the indoor trainer, which I've been utilizing a lot. And if you haven't, you need to check out those streams. I have been racing and racing those live. So if you drop into those, do say hi. And if you do see it pop up, just come in and say hello. Garmin Varia has a software update. We have it installed. I'm not sure if it works with the Wahoo or not, but what it's supposed to show is the speed of the cyclist and the speed of the cars that are passing by, which will be great after the fact. I think that'll make the Varia a much more useful device. You can also pair it to your phone and all the switches are in there, so that's really cool. The one issue that I am having with the Wahoo is that it won't connect to the Frontier uh, X2 heart rate monitor, which is unfortunate because that device is absolutely fantastic. I love the data that it provides. I use it all the time in the trainer. It pairs with that perfectly, but with my head unit, it just doesn't want to do it. So what I found is I've been wearing a heart rate monitor as well as the Frontier monitor because I just want that data as a whole. So here I am riding with two heart rate monitors and that's fine, but hopefully they get a fix soon or potentially what I'll be doing is switching to the Garmin because I like this heart rate monitor that much. Anyways, thanks guys for tuning in. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button so you get notifications. And until next time, see ya.